it is great fairy carrie and in today's five star island tour i am showing you the most incredibly terraformed island it is absolutely gorgeous i know you're gonna love it and there's absolutely zero time travel before we get started though guys check out the description box down below everything you need is down there um, all of my social medias, if you'd like for your island to be featured, just DM me on Twitter. It'll be down there as well. And don't forget to like and subscribe for some more awesome island tours. And let's go ahead and get going. I'm going to just start off by showing you guys the map real quick because the map is incredible. Look at all of this terraforming and it looks amazing. Oh, and she gave me this beautiful outfit. I cut out the footage of the outfit just because um, my pockets were full and it was I struggle to get everything. But the walkway at the very beginning, I love how the walkway leads to the museum and you just see gold roses and waterfalls and it's super girly and then it cuts straight to dinosaurs. The museum walkway is gorgeous. This hair is so cute. Oh, that was so sweet of her to give that to me. So she gave me the hair and the kimono and the shoes. And those flowers on the beach, I dropped there because I'm terrible. <laughs> the beach is set up so well. This looks exactly how someone's beach would look if they had a little beach house cute little place to hang out and eat picnics and a nice little lifeguard station. I love these picnic blanket patterns that I've been seeing people lay on their island. I think that they are so cute. And they make spaces look so well put together as well. Oh, and I think we're moving on to the little boardwalk area. This area looks so fun. You can play some games and get some popcorn. Oh, this is wonderful. Oh, the beach club. My character never wants to sit down. <laughs> Every tour I do, my character never wants to sit down. I love how there's sand in this area though. Anytime I see someone using the sand terraforming on their island itself, I get really excited for those areas. Especially with the little palm trees in there. That was really awesome. Oh, and Godzilla on the beach. Oh, the steel walkway. I haven't seen anyone use these yet. I love the outdoor gym. Immediately sits down. That is how lazy my character and myself are. This is such a perfect gym. I love that there's a little basketball net over here. That's really cute to incorporate that with the gym. A little scooter outside the gym as well. Oh my gosh, so many gnomes. I love how outside the orchard is lined with bell trees and black roses. Oh, and all the bear family. That big one is so cute. Look at its little feet, I love that. Also, oh, bear hideout, that's perfect. Also, I really love it when people put the little stereos or anything that plays music around their island. That way different areas have different songs. I think it adds a lot to the island. And I love this orchard. I should use the wooden pads in between the trees. That looks so nice. And she did a really good job with fences. I a lot of the times find myself stuck putting fences in a very like aesthetically pleasing way on my island. But I love seeing other people's fencing, it helps me with my ideas for it. Oh, and the garden. Beautiful. So I'm assuming this is where she makes her little hybrid flowers and she even has blue roses. 
Those are very difficult to get, so kudos to her. And a hoppy place! The hoppy places are the best places! This is such a gorgeous area to sit and have tea. It's on its own little island with the waterfall behind it. This is oh, amazing. I love how there's just that one flamingo in the middle of the fountain. It looks so put together. Extremely well done. And we're hopping. Oh, it's mushroom lamps. This entire area just is flawless. This is perfectly decorated. I love the lily players and the light. This is an amazing yard. Amazing yard. I love how many fountains are here as well. We've seen the fountains maybe like three or four times already. Oh, just look at the custom designs laid out and it all ties together so well. There's a lot of pink elements here which make it cute and girly but it's not overpowering. So it still looks really nice with all the bamboo. Gorgeous. How relaxing. I love this. Oh, and I just stepped on her lily in the valley. Oh no. Just the entire area. Even just the detail of the bushes lining the tops. I love. And headed in the house. This is such a nice living room. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. The diamond ring sitting right here. The item is 60. I think it's 69,000 bells. It's very expensive. This looks so nice. This looks like a real life living room. It even has a little vacuum cleaner and they added the light switch. Did anyone else get the light switch item out of one of the balloons? And it said switch and you got excited and thought that you got a switch, an actual Nintendo switch, because that definitely did not happen to me multiple times. Oh my goodness, this office is amazing. There's even a little pet turtle, and the pet turtle has a pet bed. Oh my gosh. So you can get all your craft and work done in the office, of course, but you also have your laptop, so you can get your worky work done, and your typewriter, in case you have like a, a memoir to be writing about how you made such a beautiful island. This is such an elegant room. Oh, the music room. It's so pretty and elegant. And I love the KK albums on the wall. That is such a nice touch in the music room. This is such a cool bathroom. I love the deck rug right here underneath the tub. That's such a cute touch. <laughs> I love how the top floor is like a little loft. There's the kitchen, the dining room, and a little like sitting area slash living room all together. I'm just very spastically running back and forth as I talk right now. But the kitchen part has so many details. I love this kitchen island item. Oh my gosh. That is amazing. Oh, and the bedroom's in the basement. That's awesome. I haven't seen anyone make their basement as the main bedroom, but it's really smart because it's such a large room. And the doggies right here, how adorable. Oh, and there's a Nintendo Switch I was talking about earlier. And all of the villagers are on the wall. Love that. I always love seeing villager posters in the house. And back out we go. Oh, I even like how she's done the stairway right here with the bushes and it just like flows right out of the yard. Private Zen Garden. This is a pri- oh my goodness. That is so creative and so nice. Imagine if that was your house and you had a private Zen Garden that was just like this. Oh my goodness, that would be a dream. 
This is beautiful. I love how the pads also match down by the house. It really does make it feel like an extension of the house. I really like that. <laughs> I tried so many times to jump this in. I just love hopping around. That is my favorite. It really is. Okay, I did not realize you could customize your beehive. That is awesome. And this area looks beautiful, especially with the bell trees. I like that she put the wagon with the flowers behind the bench. That way it's just like peeking out. <gasps> I'm already excited for that area up there. Oh, look at the blue roses. Oh my gosh, this is the little market area. Oh, I was right at the market! It's all done so well. I really enjoy seeing these little custom hat designs that people make to be like food and different display items. I love that. It's bowls of ramen, but their hats the best. This is so pretty. I like it. Just the entire view right here. Diner area! The diner has such a good view. Oh my goodness. And look, there's even food on the tables. I love the little black and white checkered diner flooring as well. Oh my gosh, dinner and a show. Because we have wrestling going on over here. Boxing bag. <laughs> this is so pretty. Oh my goodness. Look up. <gasps> that looks amazing. Oh my gosh. I love this. These lights are still like one of my favorite things. I want to figure out how to get this DIY recipe. It's a rainbow garden. That is beautiful. I still can't get over the terraforming we just saw over there. That was amazing and the little hopscotch pattern I love the little hopscotch pattern so much it looks so nice with the playground oh and another Zen garden this must be the public one Oops. <laughs> oh my goodness Check out this park. This park is amazing. This looks like a fairy tale. It really does. I love the little, I'm not sure which item this is, but it's a little sheep. It's so cute. This is just so intricate. Look at how intricate this is. Imagine how long it took to terraform all of these paths and lay out everything. This area took a lot of work, and oh my gosh, I love it. the life-size bugs in here. That's perfect. Someone's been spending a lot of time with Flick. <laughs> and even the details of just the two peach trees back there, everything, it just looks oh, so perfect for the park. And another happy park. Oh, hey, CJ, what's up? Guys, look at just the entrance to this walkway. Incredible. Oh, the space guys. That's a really nice touch, actually. Oh my gosh, the astro walkway. <gasps> this is so creative. This is gorgeous. Oh, 
Again, the amount of time this must have taken. Insane. Oh, and the bridge looks so cute, leading over to the music area. Imagine if you actually saw a concert here, and it was like just waterfalls on this little island. It's like, this is gorgeous. Oh, and that view. This is so nice. This island truly is incredible. This is such a sweet area. Oh my gosh. I love this so much. Guys, I don't know what I'm gonna do for the thumbnail of this video. Everywhere is so pretty. Oh my gosh, and look at that terraforming even going on back there. Every inch of this island is just perfectly terraformed. Oh, so pretty. Whoa! What's going on over here? Looks like the chances are not good. Oh. I love this little game area outside. It's such a cute outdoor arcade. Let's see, let's see if I make it guys. Come on, don't let me get it. Yes, I did it! Whoa, I really didn't think I would. I survived. I'm so proud. Oh, it's just so pretty. Just all of the details are crazy to me. And another beautifully terraformed area. Oh my goodness. Check it out. Oh. This is so impressive. I am absolutely astonished by this. Oh, and this must lead down to the secret beach. I love the walk down to the secret beach. area is incredible. Just every everywhere we walk, it's amazing. Oh, and those are the gold items there on the little happy spot. Oh, and the campsite. Oh my goodness, guys, this is so creative. She put her secondary villagers in the campsite and made them stay in tents. That is so smart. That adds so much to the campsite. Oh, it's gorgeous. All of the custom designs here look amazing. Beautiful campground. Oh my goodness. Guys, check out this like crazy space area up here. Ooh, ping pong. Oh, and you can even still see down there. It's so beautiful. Oh my goodness. I love how close the moon is to the telescope. <laughs> Ooh, and we're at the villagers' houses. They have huge yards. And I love their yards. Oh, these little pine cone things are so cute. Look at how cute the yards are. Oh my goodness, each one has their own unique yard. And it's outlined by the hedges. That looks wonderful. Oh, and more flower breeding area. Oh my goodness, I love this flower breeding area. It looks so nice with the, the beehives and the fences and the scarecrow. 
And the fact that she added in the little flower shop in, oh, the little greenhouse, my bad, in the flower breeding area, perfect. I also like how she used the light and the dark dirt pattern. Looked so nice. I really, really love each villager's house. The yards are decorated so well, and she even put different signs on each one's door. Oh, and we're back over to CJ. Alrighty, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed the island, please leave a thumbs up down below and leave lots of nice compliments in the comment section for the creator of this island. And do not forget to like and subscribe for more Animal Crossing videos. And once again, if you want your five star island feature, be sure to DM me on Twitter. It'll be linked down below as well. Thank you guys so much and have a good one.